We are forced to play Arcade Rivals this episode. Yo, what's going on, Leaf Nation? It's Leaf, we're back again, and welcome back to the channel. We are back with another Monopoly Hub video. This is number 10. We have hit double digits this year, and today, be, you know, we got to roll the dice, but before we do that, uh, we are playing Arcade Rivals. I, I don't know how I feel about that. Burst Arcade Rivals. I guess it's, it's quick game mode. All right, so we're going to quickly hop to the board and try to open up some packs here. So here we go, rolling for the first time this episode. We get a six. A six is open up a special pack, and for this episode, we're not gonna do the random number generator. There's a pack in the store that I wanna open that's gonna help the team out big time. I'm cheating a little bit, I'm sorry guys. So if we look in the store right now, there's a 75K pack out, multi-league pack, 25 items, 10 gold players, and at least one 84 plus overall player. We get a 60% 60, 60 chance at an 85 plus, a 29% chance at a purple. So here we go, we're opening this one. I know I'm cheating a little bit here, boys. I apologize, but we need some upgrades to this team here. So here we go, hoping for the best. The big boy pack. Our 84 is a goaltender, Jenna Silvonen. And that's what I get for cheating, I feel like. All right, let's just see if there's anything else in this pack. Hopefully there is. Bark, Clay, Goudreau, Scott Wedgwood. Nothing too great. I can't believe the 184 that we get is a goaltender that we probably won't use. I believe she was 5'10 as well. Allmark's definitely the better goaltender there. Um, that's kind of what I get for trying to cheat. Rasmus Anderson won't be an upgrade to our team, unfortunately. Justin Danforth, Kyle Palmieri, and that pack is absolute garbage. Okay, so this 84, uh, definitely not going to be playing for us, unfortunately. 5'5", 134, uh, definitely not going to be it. Just, just an unfortunate special pack. Okay, we also have two packs unopened, a mini pack and a premium pack. I doubt there's anything in them, but they're just chilling in our un unopened packs. Why? I'm not too sure, so uh first packs off to a great start and then the premium pack i mean we pulled who do we pull from the premium pack last week someone good i think a barzell maybe uh nothing in this one so that's beautiful all right so that's what i get for cheating we're just gonna hop into the first game of the episode the team hasn't changed at all no upgrades were made from that pack unfortunately i, I feel so like that's what we got out of that pack I, I feel cheated but it's okay so oh my god okay so arcade rivals it's a one minute periods 5v5 so we might do three episodes this game maybe even four I'm, I'm not too sure four games is what i meant this episode so let's just hop into a game here i've yet to play arcade rivals i'm kind of scared to see what it's gonna feel like uh, should be interesting guys loading into the first game crosby dry set o'connor all right we're hoping for the best here like i said i have not touched burst rivals uh burst arcade rivals i'm not sure how this is gonna be one minute periods though, so these should be quick, quick games. All right, we went 2-0 last episode. We're hoping to do the same this episode, maybe 3-0. We might play three games this episode. Like I said, maybe even four since the periods are so short. Uh, we'll find out. Over across, Tevu Teravine, and what a save from Vasilevsky. All right, so hits are like so easy to get in this. So we're going for hits all day. Bad pass. Hold on, that works out. Jack Eichel. Jack Eichel, what a save. We're getting raw from Vasilevsky. Nothing new though. John Carlson with a big shot. That's a big save. All right, McKinnon. Let's not let him burn us. What a save from Allmark. He did burn us. I said, let's not let him burn us. And he burnt us. Showfield. Take it to the next Showfield. That should be a goal. What a save from Vasilevsky. We cannot buy a goal. The period's already over. Oh my God. The period is already done. That's crazy. I, I kind of like that though. Fast games are nice. End of one. It's 0-0. Zero, zero. It was a quick period. Not really much to say. Stay with them, and that's a great pass across, and it's a one nothing hockey game, which isn't good. These periods are quick. We're going to have to try to generate offense very quickly here. Quinn Hughes over to Tevu. Tevu, take it to the net, buddy. Oh, my God. That was the weakest shot ever. Oh, my God. Over across, and there it is. Dry settle. We get it right back. Beautiful, beautiful. We finally saw Vasilevsky tied game once again. We're going to try to gain the lead for the first time this game. Sergachev misses that hit, absolutely misses that hit. Oh my god, oh boy, that could have been bad. End of two, playing well, tied game, another quick period ahead. Skate, buddy. Nice little LT. Beautiful. Oh my god, what a move. He just got a stick on that. I really wanted that over to the left guy, not the guy in the slot. Unfortunate. We're getting close. Oh, Sergachev totally missed that hit. Cover that pass. Beautiful, and he's still... Got it after I covered that pass. 
Uh, I'm a little dumbfounded there. I feel like that shouldn't have happened. I, I cover that pass because I know he's going to go back. And my guy doesn't pick up the puck and Huberto kind of just tucks it in. I I don't know how to feel about that. And we're probably going to lose that game off of that. That's unfortunate. No one really with him. Low shot rebound. Schofield. Oh, Huberto just picked that up. It's hit City Galore here. We missed that one. We control the goalie. We make a huge save. Our defenseman helps out. 37 seconds left. Sergachev need a hit. Oh my god. It, that was just horrible goaltending from Allmark. Okay. We lose this game. I don't think we're going to come back down two with 33 to go. Just unfortunate. Let's see if we can get one more goal. Two seconds to go. Miles Woods. And it's not going to happen. GG's. We lose three to one. Arcade Rivals. I, I'm not really mad about it. And I mean, like, it was a close game. Again, Arcade Rivals, it's kind of hard to judge, like, who really should have won that game, I guess. I don't know. But with that being said, we head back to the board, rolling for the second time this episode, hoping for another special pack, maybe? Let's see. And we get a six. So a six is buy any special card. Looking at the coin total, we, are, we have 12,687 coins to spend on a special card. Let's see what we can get with that. All right, so we got a Jake Ensel uh, under prime times. A Johnny Goudreau wouldn't be a bad shout at an 85 overall. I think I saw Elias Pedersen as well. So we got some decent looking cards under prime times. Team of the week, Morgan Riley, Brady Kachuk. Uh, that's about it under team of the weeks. Hot 23, we got Brent Burns at forward. I don't know how I feel about that. He looks pretty slow. So in all honesty, I think the best cards are coming out of these prime times. Right now we're looking at Jake Ensel. We're looking at Johnny Goudreau and maybe Elias Patterson. Goudreau looks amazing, man. 90 speed, 90 excel. Very good shot. Looking at Patterson, 88 speed, 88 excel. Well-rounded shot. I'm kind of tempted to go with Johnny Goudreau. Patterson is 6'2", 176. Goudreau is 5'9", 165. So they're both going to get knocked off the puck pretty easily. Um, maybe we'll just go with who has a better strength. Strength, 79. Strength, 82. You know what? We're going to try Elias Pedersen. Why not? So we are going to pick him up for 11.1K out of the 12.6 that we have. I feel like that's a pretty good upgrade for the team. So now the coin total is at just under 1,600 coins, which is good that we did that this way because if we go bankrupt, we don't have a lot of coins. I mean, I think now it is time for John Tavares to go. Either John Tavares or Miles Wood. I'm not too sure. It might be Miles Wood that's going to go. I don't want to throw Tapani down to the fourth line. So that means Schofield might be going down to the fourth line. So there are the changes to the team. The second line looking better. Eichel, Pedersen, and Barzell. I do want to see what his faceoff ratings uh, is here. 81, 79 compared to Jack Eichel. So maybe we throw Eichel on the wing. Um, I don't know how we're going to do this. What's Barzell's rating here? 78, 79. So maybe we'll just keep it that way. And then Schofield's on the fourth line with Tavares and Alexander Ovechkin. So looking good. We're going to head into the second game of the episode. All right. What are we coming up against? 89 Poulin, 88 Zegers, and 88 Tevu Teravainen. Decent little team. Hoping to come out with the win this time around though. All right. It is a debut of Mr. Elias Patterson on that second line. So I'm excited to try him out. Hopefully he is a good card. It's going to gonna kind of be hard to tell if he's good or not in this mode to be fair so uh, we'll see and he passes it across to mckinnon and straight away we are down one nothing early on my defense can't defense uh amazing, 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 amazing. but so was mckinnon leon doesn't care quick pass team Solani. oh my god his goaltender played that very well big hit there we're gonna go for that hit nice save from Allmark. play the puck 10 to 1, not great. We didn't get much done offensively, unfortunately. We move on to the second. Hughes quickly over. Solani quickly over. Tevu Teravainen. Low shot rebound. It was there for the taking. Zegers just got there first. We're going to set the second line next period. I have not seen Elias Pedersen at all. It's literally a one line game in this mode. Second period, we're starting with the second line. Eichel, Barzell, and Pedersen. Let's see if Pedersen could get us that goal that we're looking for here. There you go, Fox. There you go, Fox. Adam Fox off to the races. Adam Fox, what a save, dude. Nice puck pickup. Over across, Pedersen with a shot, Eichel. And it comes off of Elias Pedersen, a rebound. First assist of the series for him in his debut. Amazing first shift. We made the right decision playing the second line to start off the period. It's a tied hockey game. Dreisaitl, Tevu Teravainen. Over across, dry sidle. Oh, I thought that puck got through. And Tebu Teravainen is struggling to get up there. 
Oh no, what is Sergachev doing? Oh my god, that was horrible from our AI. Huge hit there. Gonna need another one. Thank you, John Carlson. I have 21 hits. For a guy who normally doesn't hit and hut, that's a lot. Overtime period, three on three. I don't know how this is gonna go with the hitting. I really don't. It shall be interesting. Let's see, boys. Let's see. She's gonna go around that net looking for absolutely anything. She can't find nothing as Eichel just wanted to follow me the whole time for some reason. It's a two on one the other way. It's over across. What a save from Allmark. We play the puck this time around. Up the ice. Tapani took that long to get off of the uh, get up off the ice. Huge hit there. We get a penalty for it. Because why not? Byram dodges that hit. Can't dodge that one though. And is a penalty? Okay, so four on three. I thought it might have been a penalty shot. Oh, that might be game. Huge save from Allmark. Absolutely huge save. Looking for something or anything. Low shot rebound. Oh my god. That was greatly redirected there. Need a hit. Out of boy Carlson. Don't know where the puck is. He comes out with that somehow. What a save from Allmark. No one's with him. Tevu to John Carlson. John Carlson looking to make something happen. Oh my god. That would have been beautiful to end the game there like that. 2.7 before we head to a shootout. What is this game? All right. Tapani, our first shooter here. Looking for something. And she gets it. She's been so good for us in this series. one nothing game in the shootout. Let's go. All right. Allmark has been great all game. Need a huge save. We're going to get it too. We absolutely read that. Let's go. Jack Eichel looking to make it 2 nothing here. Going to go wide. Stick to the backhand again. Oh, that is a huge save from his goaltender. Good from him. Good from him. All right. Poulin coming up on Allmark. We need a save here. And we're going to get it from Allmark. That is beautiful. Now, if we score here, we end the game. And it's up to Alexander Ovechkin, who got demoted two episodes ago, to win this in the shootout. What can he do? Oh, that is a fantastic diving poke. And it's up to Linus Allmark to end it here. And it's up to Zegris to keep it going. Allmark, let's see what we can do here, buddy. Here we go. Comes Zegris. And we read it. And we win it in a shootout. What a save from Linus Allmark absolute huge win for this team you love to see it things you just love to see i mean this game mode is kind of fun i'm not gonna lie all right so we're gonna do one more game but before that we have some packs to open nothing too big just a three gold players pack and a premium pack so we're gonna see if there's anything in here to help upgrade the team i highly doubt it by field grunstrom nothing gonna help us out there and then a premium pack maybe just maybe we pull something in here i again just doubt it you never know with these packs so capo kaku not gonna help out the team kako sorry and uh, Tolvainen, who won't help out the team either. So let's just head to the board. All right, so we landed on buying a special card last roll. We're hoping for something good here. We're rolling for the last time this episode, and we get a nine. And a nine is open up any special pack. We are not going to cheat this time. Looking at the store here, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight special packs out. We are gonna do a random number generator, one to eight to see which pack we get to open. Once eight here, generating, hoping for a decent special pack. And we get a three. So a three isn't a bad pack. 30 players, 15 gold players, which is good, and a guaranteed of at least 382 overalls. So it's not a bad pack. We're gonna hope for the best here. We get 382 overalls. We're hoping for a purple. So here we go. We didn't cheat this time. So maybe this is where we get a very, very good pull. Dougie Hamilton being one of them. That is a very good pull. 83 overall, Dougie Hamilton. We will take that. Welcome to the team. He will definitely make the right side of our defense. Uh, Jeff Skinner. Okay, so it doesn't count as one of the 82 pluses, which is good. Uh, keeping it going here. Ilya Sorokin. Okay. Omar just had an amazing game, so we're going to keep him in. But it's good to always have Ilya Sorokin as an option. So that's an 84 right there. 84 and an 83, which isn't too bad. Uh, Lazan, Cal Foot. Still a lot of this pack left. Milan Lucic there. Okay, come on. One more 82 plus. It's going to be Brock Besser, who could possibly make the team. This card doesn't look too bad, to be honest. Good skating, good shooting. He might make the team, which is good. So, uh, all right, we'll take that. Uh, okay, a centerman, Petra Niemen. Hopefully, I said her name right. She looks actually pretty good. 80 face offs, good speed, good shot. She will make the team. What a W pack. See what happens when you don't cheat the system. Vladimir Tarasenko too. Oh my god, this pack just keeps getting better and better. Last four cards in this pack. Don't think there'll be anything because we pulled so much already. But man, we will definitely take that. So that's what? One, two, three, four, 
a potential five upgrades to the team. That is absolutely insane. Logie Hamilton and an 83 will be coming in for Neil Pionk. Our like left side technically is looking very good here. So our pairings are looking good. Again, Fox, Hughes, Carlson, Sergachev, Hamilton, Byram, uh, just amazing. Our defense looks very good. We could probably upgrade uh, the last two pairings here with Byram and Sergachev, but other than that, it's looking great. Tarasenko is probably going to be coming in for Troy Terry, so let's quickly change that. Not that Troy Terry has been bad, but it's, it's just a plus one upgrade. So now Tarasenko is on that third line with Jack Hughes and Tapani. And then I think it is time for John Tavares to finally come off of this team. And Petra Niemen is coming into this team to play fourth line minutes with Alexander Ovechkin and uh, Schofield. Uh, I, I kind of like Hughes with Tapani and Tarasenko. We're going to keep that line together. I like Eichel with Barzell and Pedersen. We're going to keep that line together. And I don't think Besser is going to be making this team because eventually we will be upgrading this Alexander Ovechkin back. So the sad thing is, is these upgrades in Tarasenko and Yemen won't get much playing time this episode uh, just because of the one minute period. Same with Hamilton, but maybe I will make it a thing uh, one of the periods we're going to start with those lines. Last game of the episode against Unhinged Canuck. I think we know him. Lemieux, Duchesne, Kachuk. Unreal team. This should be a good game. Tapani with a good hit there. Quick passing. Beautiful Tarasenko. Dodges a hit. Take a shot. Okay, that's all right. Knee quick passes. I tried getting it to the point there. Tarasenko's hurt. Not a good first shift. Not good. And he is hurt. Our newest, oh no, it's not our player. Roman Yossi got hurt off of hitting Tarasenko? No, okay, tap a knee. All right, okay, don't mess with her, guys. Don't know where the puck is. It kind of just landed at his feet. That gets, like, how does my defenseman not pick that puck up? It gets across somehow. It's a one nothing hockey game. Sometimes this game can be frustrating, but I'm not mad about it. It's arcade rivals. Starting the next period with our second forward line, since it worked last game, we're going to hope it works this game. We have zero shots on goal. That's not good. David coming in, need a hit there, beautiful, need another bump, maybe another hit from Carlson, he gets it, oh the rebound and it's in to the back of the net, my team doesn't know how to pick up loose pucks and that is why we're losing this game, well also because it's Rivals Arcade, one shot and two periods, lovely. You see Oaken in and his player got hurt, which might have just saved us a goal, I I'm not sure, Patterson. Barzell, Patterson, oh my god, nice try. And we're gonna get shut out, unfortunately. Again, Rivals Arcade, it's a fun mode, I'm not gonna lie. You know, usually I would rage at the game, today I didn't. All right guys, that is it for today's Monopoly HUD episode. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. We are on the road to 5,000 subscribers. So if you're not subscribed to the channel, consider hitting the subscribe button down below. Uh, hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. We made some huge upgrades to the team. Played Burst Arcade Rivals for the first time, which honestly was kind of fun. I I, I, I enjoyed it. I'm not going to lie. But guys, like I said, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!